Season's greetings, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in the need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSFW versions on this ASMR. This is for all ages and it's appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some pockies, and enjoy this ASMR. You're awake. <laughs> Thank goodness you're alright. Don't worry, you're safe. I just got you out of the rain and brought you out here in time in the cave. Don't worry, I'm not here to hurt you. <laughs> Looks like you were about to get attacked by a bunch of monsters out there. Good thing I arrived on time before they make a move. Oh, I was just prepping up some soup, which I prepped up myself. Here. Don't be shy. Have some. Are you having a hard time holding it? I don't mind feeding you. Just lift up your head. Sit up first. That's it. Every last bit of it. How are you feeling right now? That's good. Hmm? Oh. Um, it's a long story. Um, my name's Norman. I'm a little new from around here, so... Um, what about you? What's your name? Nice to meet you, listener. I wonder... Why are you around here? Like... Are you with someone? No. Oh, you weren't alone. Family? Friends? Once your friends. How did that happen? you to some demons. <laughs> That's funny. Me and my friends are dealing with demons ourselves. But, uh, I guess you're just another kid. Like us. Right? Wait, what? You're not like me. What do you mean? I mean, you look like me. And we speak the same language. What do you mean? Uh, are you saying... You're one of them? No, nothing's wrong, it's just me and my friends were running away from your kind, and we see your kind as evil, and we despise your kind. You see, we were being held in an orphanage which we discovered was a farm for demons. We are known as demon meat. And your kind eats us. Yeah. And we try to run away, but it appears I may have saved a demon that 
wants to eat me. What? You're not going to eat me? But you're a demon. You demons eat heat on human flesh, especially us kids. This doesn't make sense. How can you be a demon that doesn't eat human flesh? Hold on. Are you telling me you're a demon that doesn't eat human flesh, but find other ways to process food for yourself? Are you lying to me? You must be manipulating me. I don't think a demon could ever be a vegetarian on not eating human flesh. Fascinated of my kind. <laughs> really? You're fascinated of my kind? <laughs> How can I trust you? I know. You're trying to plot something. I don't know what it is, but I know you're up to something. And I'm gonna stop you for it. Ugh. I have a weapon that I created. It may not kill a demon, but I have that just in case. If you're plotting to do something to me, you know what'll happen. Where are you going? Oh, I see. You're scared. Is that it? You're leaving. I saved you. And you're not gonna thank me. You didn't thank me earlier. Fine. How about you just go? Go ahead. Leave. I can't believe I saved you for nothing. Until I found out who you really are. I'm not stopping you. Hey, listener. How about you come back? Yeah. Come back in. Yeah. Yeah, you can sit back down. Look. I'm really sorry. I guess you weren't really planning on anything to hurt me, and I guess I was just being very judgmental. I deeply apologize for my actions and for my words. Thank you, listener. Mm. Telling you from the time. I guess should rest up. I guess you've been through a lot. There's more soup if he ever needs anything to digest. Mm -hmm. I'll just be over there. Just stay as warm as possible. Don't worry. I'm not gonna hurt you. And say it all. Don't even have a weapon. Yeah, I guess I was trying to make myself sound tough, but I don't have one. I promise. I don't. You know, getting to know you, you seek a fascination. 
Something about you I've never seen from a demon before. How about you sit over here and we can talk? Yeah. You do seek my interest. I'd like to know why you choose not to eat me, nor eat human meat. I'll let you start from the beginning, and I'll listen. <laughs> 